In this video, we're covering the Toro T5 rotor with rapid set arc adjustment. We'll go over a few of the features, show you how to change out a nozzle, and make some adjustments. I'm Dwayne Smith, your Sprinkler Warehouse Product Specialist. Let's get started. This is the Toro T5 rapid set rotor with check valve. They call this the rapid set rotor because you can adjust the pattern quickly and without tools. As you can see right now, this is how the pattern's set. It's not in the correct position and it's too small. I'm going to point the nozzle where I want the right stop along the path right here, like this by cranking the turret. Now I move the position of the entire pattern. What I want is the pattern to go from 90 degrees from here to here along the pathway right here to next to the flower bed here. So from the right stop, I crank the turret back here, aiming the nozzle down the flower bed edge where I want the left stop to be. And I turn the nozzle back to the stopping point along the walkway. Now I've got my 90 degree pattern like this. If we wanted to go 180 degrees as though the path continued along this direction, from the right stop, I just crank the turret around aiming the left stop here. And now I have 180 degrees. Now let's reset it to 90 degrees. I turn the nozzle all the way to the right stop, then I rotate it to the 90 degrees that I want and crank the turret right back to the right stop. Now I have a 90 degree pattern. As I mentioned, this rotor has a check valve. When a zone of your irrigation system has a slope, often when the sprinklers shut off, the water in the pipes empty out of the lowest heads. This wastes water and causes pooling and erosion. Having a check valve on your head keeps that from happening. This rotor comes with this set of nozzles. These nozzles have what Toro calls airfoil technology. They create a zone of low pressure just under the stream of water, which makes for very uniform distribution, and it's gentle enough to not wash away freshly laid grass seed. This rotor has a pop-up height of five inches. That's one inch higher than your standard rotors, great for taller grasses. This inlet right here is three quarter inch. The arc on this rotor can be set anywhere from 40 to 360 degrees. The T5 has a watering distance of 25 to 50 feet, depending on the nozzle installed and how the radius adjustment screw is set. Looking at the top of the rotor, this is the pull-up slot. Use the rotor tool for that. Over here is the arc adjustment slot. In addition to the tool-free adjustment, you can adjust the arc with this as well. Over here, this raised area is the radius adjustment slot. Use a rotor tool like this one or a small flathead screwdriver. And you're also going to access that when you're changing out a nozzle. So let's go see this rotor in action. With the water off, insert the tool in the pull-up slot, quarter turn, and pull up. Hold the riser up with your hand and back out the radius adjustment screw. You're getting it out of the way of the nozzle. Pull out the nozzle with a pair of needle nose pliers or pry out the nozzle with the tool. Insert the new nozzle. Bring the radius adjustment screw back down. When you let back down the riser, don't let it pinch your hand. I learned that the hard way. Now with the water back on, turn the radius adjustment screw to set your radius. That is the watering distance. You want the spray from this rotor to reach the next closest rotor. That's called head-to-head -head coverage. And that is the Toro T5 rotor with rapid set. Buy yours today on sprinklerwarehouse.com. Remember, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything you need to make your trees, lawn, flower beds, and gardens lush and beautiful. Questions? Chat with one of our incredible customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really do know their stuff and they'll get you squared away. Subscribe to our YouTube channel for helpful tips, tutorials, and general sprinkler instruction. Sprinkler Warehouse, America's most shop sprinkler store.